What is up everybody? It's your boy T-Red and Smitty and we are the Konami Crew guys and today we have today we're going to do a couple couple little experiments here. Uh, first we're going to see how many cards it takes to stop uh, many, an arrow. How many cards we got? There's, 50? there's probably 60 card 60. deck there and then we have some other stuff that we're going to get into and see if it can stop an arrow as well. Um, so sit back and enjoy this. It should be a pretty pretty interesting video. Just to start off wise, we have we have 60 Yu-Gi-Oh cards here. We're all not in sleeves. Raw. Ooh, baby, sleeves. I like it. And we're gonna start off. We're gonna start off. We have a we have a crossbow here, and we're we're gonna see. This is like a pistol grip crossbow. I'm sorry, a little bit here, Smitty. All right, so this is about a 10 yard shot. Yeah, close to roughly. it. Roughly. Uh, with that being said, go ahead and let her fly, Smitty. Got safety on there. Alright, safety's off, firing. Your is so hard. Whoa. I think I hit it then. It's hard, it's hard. Do you wanna try it? Like the fucking the trigger is like stupid hard okay, to pull. So Shot number one, it was a, a miss. I think you just hit the side of it. So overall, those cards are still there. The, the arrow did not get hit. All right, guys, we got T-Red up. Right, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna give it a shot and see what I can hit. This about 10 yards or so. And uh, we'll see what we can do here. Firing now. You hit? Check out. Where did I hit? That was yours. Oh, no look. Oh, you necked it. So it's got to be right off to the side. Right there. It's right there. So, so far we have zero hits. I nicked the side of it, but didn't actually get a direct hit. Since me and Smitty's uh, uh, shooting is uh, subpar, we're yeah. going to step it into about five yards. It's half the distance. So, uh, half the distance. You see, there's the cards. Whoa. And he got a direct Look. hit. Um, however, though, it did not go through. Dude, it stopped like. I got two here. I got two that got. That right there is it. So it went about halfway through. All right, guys, so we were actually only able to go through about 20 or 30 of the cards here, so it did not even make it halfway through. And that so, was at five yards. And that so was that at, was, I mean, at point that was blank, close. point blank range. So next, <laughs> we are going to actually step it up from a crossbow to the compound bow. So we're gonna step it up, and we're gonna see what we can do here. Bam, you see it. Whew. Matthew's compound bow. This conquest too. So there you guys have it. This is what we're gonna do next. We're Where you wanna shoot from about 15? I'd say with that, you're pretty, you're pretty dead nose with that. Let's do 15 yards. It's the face of a true champion here, guys. Holy, he missed. Miss! Yeah, I just, I, I like slid right on the side of him last shot. Take number two, here he is. Let's get a POV on. Are you serious? I in, dude. Same That's like spot. same fucking spot. Same spot, dude. Hard to hit, I'm gonna step it in about five yards. So, I went ahead and stepped a little closer. Try not to skin my this arm. Is, this right here is pretty much point blank. If he can't hit here, he can't hit in squat. Golly. Did you get it? Yeah. Look. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. Didn't go through these. Oh! <laughs> Looks like 43. 43 cards. It takes 43 cards to stop an, uh, an arrow. Look at that, dude. It like so, spiraled. For all you guys who are running 40 card decks, <laughs> you might want to run three more. Yeah, that's pretty sick, though. That's like a Sword of Excalibur right there. So yeah. Good job of that. Yeah. Ah! That's, a nice, that's a nice uh, trophy piece, mantle piece there. Man, I can't believe it didn't go all the way through them, though. You know? All right, guys. We got something a little more. We're stepping. The, we're up in the ante a little bit. We have a sealed container of furniture polish, and we're gonna see how how it withstands two 
the arrow from a com from a compound bow. This is gonna be pretty sick. You yeah, ready? What do you think is gonna happen? Uh, it's gonna spray. It's gonna go right through. Do you think it's gonna like take off? Yeah, like, it might. Like, because in, in my head, what I'm thinking is gonna happen. It's gonna hit and it's gonna spray like and, yeah. and go somewhere with it. If, if if the hole has enough pressure, anyway. Yeah. You ready? You know what I'm saying? Oh, I know, babe. All right. Let's see what you got. <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> See, I knew where I needed to aim then. Holy guacamole. Yeah, it sprayed. Damn, polish that furniture, baby. Yeah. Let's see, let's see the damage. I think it fucked my arrow up. <laughs> I don't think I can get it out. Damn, it all went all the way through it until the very end. Yeah. Holy cow. I yeah, like, fuck the, the tangs up or whatever they're called. Tines. Look well, at Can you see me? Nice. Plum. Okay, so on this next one, we have a Rip It Energy 4th of July edition. Happy uh, happy holidays, everybody. I got some of that furniture polish on me. Uh, <laughs> so we're going to see how this withstands, and we're actually changing up arrows. The last shot ruined the arrow, so what we got on this one? Got a nice pointy. You ready? All right, here we go, guys. Rip it energy, take <laughs> take one. Oh! Got it! Dang, it went plumb through. That thing is aluminum, though. Yeah, it's mini. Tell me how it tastes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Tell me how it tastes. <laughs> oh, that tastes good. It's fruit punch. So we saw how it did against like a whole like deck of cards, and we thought that was kind of cool. But how would it do against a whole deck of cheese? Cocaine. Sunny Acres singles, American style, pasteurized processed sandwich slices. So it's not even real cheese. See, I think this thing is gonna go plumb through the cheese like it's nothing, just because it's cheese. But who knows? We're gonna see what happens here. Uh, I got something on my lens I'm going to get off, but uh, we'll see what happens. Me, tell us what you think is going to happen. Uh, it's going to go through the cheese. Craft Singles, off-brand, take one. Get the bugs off your neck. Are you serious? You missed? You missed? Right above it, dude. Damn. All right, here it is, guys. Crossbow against the Craft Single Generic Off Brand, take two. Are you serious, dude? I want to put that on bologna sandwich and eat it. Take three. You got it. Got her. Dude, the trigger is so strong on this. Yeah. That Where's the trigger? Yeah. We can still shoot it with an arrow to see how far it goes. Look at it. <laughs> Hell no. Eat a piece of cheese out of it. <laughs> Tastes like. Like furniture polish. I ain't eating the cheese, dog. Got him. 16 men on a dead man's chest. Uh, back at 10? No, this ain't back at. This, oh, is, this, is, this is the world class grade in 2003 Yu Gi Oh! Graceful Charity Hall Fool. Guys, we've done some other stuff, but you know, we are primarily a Yu Gi Oh! channel, so we got to bring it back to Yu Gi Oh! We got to shoot. We're going to see how well it's going to hold up. You want to use the you want to use the compound for this, or you want to use. I'm using Old Graceful Charity. Using Old Graceful Charity. All right, guys, here we go. We're gonna see now. Just a disclaimer on this, but these cards are like the worst graded. They're loose in there. They're not even tight, tightly graded. It's really only probably worth nothing because it's world class grading and it ain't PSA. If it ain't PSA, we don't want you. You ready? Yep. I'm gonna let her fly. God, got him, dude! Holy cannoli! 
That was a cannoli. Look at that, dude. Did it even go through the card? Yeah. Looks like it bent it backwards. Oh, it does, doesn't it? Looks like it didn't even pierce the card. Yeah, it did, Terry. Look at that white slurry. That was nasty, dude. I kind of wanted to get a better hit than that. You want to try it again? Yeah, let's do it again. That cheese is making me hungry. <laughs> go eat you a slice. <laughs> He shattered it on that one. <laughs> Dang, he shattered her. That's a shatter foil. Alright. Where'd the arrow go? How's it look? Ain't bad. That's off-centered as hell. How the hell did they give that a 10? Look how off-centered it is. Look how heavy the border is on that side versus that side. Oh my god. Yeah, that's way off. World class grading, it's not very world class. Now it's on to something a little more up to date here. Um, we have for you guys one of these graded cars that you get out of those mystery power boxes that we open on the channel. It's by Beckett. It's a BCCG. And it's a, it's a graded 10. So we saw how, this is a little bit better grade. If you look, it's got like a plastic case on it on the inside. If you look, it's actually got like a plastic case on it on the inside, and then it's got the actual case on it. So I think this is a little bit better graded. So what do you think is gonna happen? I think it's gonna blow plumb through it. Well, if I can hit her just right. What if it just snapped the arrow tip? It just, it was such, such good grade of plastic, it just stopped it dead in its tracks. I'd be very impressed. Whose neighbor kids are crazy? Oh, a jerk. Got her. <laughs> Got her. Dead. Oh, dude, that's what I was wanting you to do is pin, her, pin the tail to the donkey. Pin her down. Pin the tail to the donkey. Son. Pin her down. Oh, yeah, it's like upside down. Double sleeved. It's double sleeved. Let me set this. It's going to be a little rough getting this out of here. We'll get it, though. Old flame goes from coast to coast. So honestly, these are very well packaged compared to the world class. World class green is trash, let's be honest. Oh, let's be honest. Next up, we have bathroom, bathroom cleaner. Kind of racing, I'm not Shoot you in the it. belly. Oh! Yeah. Oh! Yeah. Look at that arrow, dude. <laughs> Look at that arrow. Damn. She is. That looks fucking wicked. <laughs> she is creamed up. Oh, she's so creamed up. Creamed. Mm, cream, yeah, lady, cream. cream. This is it. This is this is what we really want to know. Sealed 2012 Mega 10. We're gonna we're gonna shoot this thing and then we're gonna see what was in it. Open it up for you guys. A little shooter, shoot and save. Yeah. Hopefully he'll miss the packs. It's called the blind shot. Because there could be a ghost rare in there. If there's a ghost rare, then I'm going to be really upset. Because it's like 150 graded. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully. Aluminum arrow versus aluminum tin. Oh my oh, god. He went right through the packs. Did he I? went right through the packs, dude. Did I? No. Yeah, we I'm might. Be, I might have got lucky, dude. You might have missed. Gordon. Get over there in the water, 45, 54. I grabbed him up, shot him, shoot him. Oh. Smitty shot this 10. I'm thinking he missed the packs if we're lucky. Um, we're going to see what we got here. I'm hoping I'm hoping he missed the packs and hopefully there's a ghost rare in it. Make sure if you guys haven't already, get entered into our giveaway. Ooh, I just barely missed it. I don't know. Uh, hang on. Before we do this, guys, we're doing a giveaway right now. We're giving away five booster packs, three sealed decks, and a signed play mat from the voice actor of Yu-Gi-Oh! GX, Astro Phoenix. So if you guys want to get into that, click the link in the description down below and get entered in to win. Here we go, guys. You see where he shot it. Oh, my God, dude. Look how close. Yeah, I knew. I look, close. dude. Look at that. That was close to can be. He missed, dude. Oh, Damn it. Let me, he try again. Let me try again. All right, here we go, guys. We're going to crack them. We're going to crack them. Nothing.
nothing. I think the ultimate rare is in these packs. One day a piece, that's good. Creepy Coney. Nothing. Oh, we got a super wind up hunter. Oh, you must have got that at the corner of that one because it's kind of yeah. big. I probably missed one shot. Oh, oh, we got a secret, dude. Dark smog. That looks pretty sick. Once per turn, you can target one monster in front of yard and field with fiend type monster banish that target. All right, guys, so we saved a dark smog. I'm super happy he did not. I don't think it's worth much, but he did not get another one of my secret rares you guys saw in the video last week he got one of my secret rares and he was excited snatched it home snatch it we we got him this time boys we got our secret rare so this is going to be pretty much the wrapping up of this video um hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure to show up by dropping a like on this video subscribe like i said for new content and uh we're gonna leave you guys with one final farewell i hope you guys enjoy it it's your boy t red Smitty. We are the Konami crew guys. We love you guys. We're out. Peace. <laughs>